morning ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the phantom your gaming world once again and today again we are playing grand theft auto 4 as you guys all know we have met dwayne right now and we are doing some work for him so let us carry on with it i'll be taking this this one all right let's get it quick with it today So compared to Dwayne, Playboy acts as a is an asshole. Yeah, he is. And we know it already. There are people in the life who get really jealous of your work and then they start throwing up shit on you. And you know, it is it is good to throw them off. Let them go. Because you are not dying without them. And they are not dying without you. So it's okay to let them go. And people who throw shit. Are the one who are shit themselves. I feel sorry for Dwayne. Because you know. It's an innocent man who lost everything. He lost his girlfriend and the friends are too way jealous of him by boy X. Yeah, he is jealous of him. Alright, so here we are at the housing projects where Dwayne lives he lives right there in that block man look at the height look at the heights of this buildings wow I wonder where Dwayne lives, in which block, I mean on which floor, undressed to kill. Dwayne? Sup, man? Not much. How are you doing? Done. I can't cope no more, man. The prison was easy compared to this shit. I'm sure it was. Fuck it, man. Fuck it all. I mean, I used to have everything. I used to run uptown, Bohan, all that shit. Now I ain't shit. Hey, let's get it back. Nah, I can't, man. I ain't got the energy no more. I've been stabbed in the back too many fucking times. I mean, there's bitches everywhere. Well, I'll do it. For you, I mean. Nah, fuck that. Come on, man, stop being so miserable. What did you lose? Shit, man. This club. I'm talking a real gentleman's place. It's called the Triangle Club on Drill Street in Bowhead. I'm talking real class, you know what I'm saying? But when I went down, some fucking gangsters came and took it. Well, I'll clean out the squatters for you. No problem. Man, you the real deal. I owe you. Big time. But we'll talk about that later. Man, you the truth. Alright, so we gotta go to the strip club. And the club uh, Dwayne was talking about, he used to owe it. And now some gangsters have took over that place. And we gotta take that place for Dwayne. You know, these were the friends I was talking about. Like, Dwayne is a real man. He isn't jealous of anything. Um, 
these kind of people are the true mates i often had friends who were really jealous of me and yeah holy crap you know i actually feel myself in this game as i've been betrayed by many people and i know many of you you have been betrayed in your lives at some point of time but i had been betrayed time to time by my own people so i can feel dwayne i can feel him people close to you are are the one who are really very jealous of you and you guys don't even know because you are really mad and they love yeah you guys must be thinking why i am talking this shit right now Let's focus on the mission. We are going to Triangle Strip Club. Uh, okay, Brucey. Yo! All right, the shit is near. This is the Triangle Club in front of me. I'll be pulling over in that parking. Let us see how many gangsters are there inside. We gotta bang each one of them, and we gotta own this place. Okay, let us see. Weapons aren't welcome in the club. All right, man. I don't need weapons. Great to see you. Okay, I thought it was. Telling us not to go inside. Take out the three strip club ma managers. All right. So let us take first one out. Locate the manager by listening in on conversations. All right. Okay. Where's Jose, man? He's in the back, but he don't want to be troubled. You know how he needs to concentrate when he's counting up that money. I'm trying to come back here. There ain't no refunds on left as Let us bang him up. Peace back here. It ain't worth it. Man. Shit. Come on. I don't have a knife, man. Shit. The manager that finally escaped. Let me take out my gun. Okay. First one is compromised. Alright, I've taken out the bouncer. Alright. Man, there are... A lot of people in here. Innocence even. Alright, let us bang one by one. Blood everywhere. Okay, so another manager is inside that private room. Okay. 
So, another target is also compromised. Let us take the last one out. And <laughs> he was trying to escape in the car. Come on, man. What are you made of? Okay. So, we have taken all the targets. And Dwayne might be really, really happy right now. Nobody's going to be partying up in your club anymore. Playboy ain't going to be happy. What do you mean? He still did business with the gangsters that took over. Screw that. They fucked me. They fucked. Right? Playboy going to feel that shit. Sure thing, man. Like, I care about him. Alright guys, I have taken this car and let us now move to the next destination. Yeah, the Dwayne isn't showing on the map so we gotta go to the Playboy X. Yeah, we will be going to him. Little Jacob. So as you guys all know, I'm recording right now so I don't really do such things as a really waste time right now and I gotta record the shit in about 30 minutes or less than that so do you guys remember that where we met Playboy X for the very first time You asked me to help out Dwayne. That's what I was doing. Don't help him out when it fucks up my business interest. Damn, son. That ain't cool. Alright. So, Playboy X. Known right now that we have shot some gangsters in the Triangle Club. And the men we shot were the men who were running down his business. Playboy X business. So, yeah. If you are stabbing back an innocent man, then you deserve it. All right, to the right. here this weather is really amazing okay so here we are much how are you chilling it's all good well mostly good mostly yeah Dwayne's been getting on my nerves pushing me man but whatever we spoke about that shit already I give him time he's just out of prison <laughs> for real listen G Dwayne ain't the only thing I got on my mind no no Some motherfuckers been calling me a phony, calling me a snitch, calling me all kinds of bullshit. Big deal. Yeah, big deal. Damn right. Until I discover that same motherfucker, well, he's got some real loose lips. Not bad. So, you need this guy silenced? Yeah, he hangs out with his team near the courts on Exeter between X and W. Okay. 
What does he look like? Well, son ain't too diesel or nothing. And he a regular looking dude, know what I mean? Now he don't flash his guap too much, but you can see it in his eye. And he a hustler. Eh? <sighs> Homie ain't too brawling, but he ain't scrawny neither. And he be styling on him a little, you dig? I mean, he ain't too bummy, but he grimy too. So he's the average one? Look, he's brown skin B. Motherfucker be rocking baggy clothes, all that. Jewels, and he stay fresh with the clean sneakers. Know what I mean? And sometimes a bandana. Look, I need more than that to go on. Jesus. Here, take this. Head down there. Take a photo. Send it to me. And I'll point out which one of them motherfuckers it is. Fine. And that's a little gift for you. All right. So Playboy has given us the colored mobile. Now we can click pictures with it. As a camera, video editor. Look. Isn't it cool? Okay. Let us get to the work. Alright, we gotta take some pictures of a gangster dude who is hustling in, in the in this basketball court maybe to my left yeah and that's why the penetrators ain't doing nothing this season they got no one who can work the lanes man shit lieutenant that's something i was forced into from the necessity of my financial I guess this situation is the one. My body is forced to rob and deal in order to sustain my own well-being the one and that of my the black family. Hey, whenever y'all ready up there. So, I got to take the pictures of the one in the black and I got to send it to the playboy so he can he can tell me what to what the next step would be. This place looks fine. Okay, let us send it to them. Okay. Yo, money. Marlon's the one in the black jacket. Smoking. Sure. I knew he was in the black jacket and now they are all alert they are looking at me let us see I'll be taking out my shotgun yeah this one where it is come on all right targets compromised we are done with the mission let us now run away marlin is dead you the man son you money you my ice cold slop let us run away All right, so we are clear up with the cops and we are done with the mission too. So if you did like the video, do it the like button, guys. Hey, Nico, it's me. Yeah? Who are you? Can you remind me? That doesn't <laughs> matter. You need to meet me.
Meet me outside the United Liberty Paper Building in Algonquin. It is very important that you be there. Goodbye. Okay, so Michelle called us that we gotta... I didn't hear it properly. We gotta come to the... some sort of a government building and... Maybe she has been filing a case over us. Another one. So, this is it for today guys. I hope you did enjoy this video. The episode was full of action indeed. I'll be definitely seeing you in the next one. Until then, do whatever you want. Enjoy the life. Bye.